Hey, hey, everybody. Welcome back to Subsistence. I'm walking towards uh, our nearby hunter. <laughs> I kind of wanted to just cruise over and see if he ever left the door open. Um, I've been a little bit curious about that. Is he looking at me? What's he doing? He's squatting. Oh, he probably wanted some privacy. <laughs> we don't know what he's doing over there, squatting in the corner. Uh, I just wanted to see if he leaves the door open. I see... It looks like it's closed here. Um, I thought I would just kind of check because I thought, you know, if he leaves it open, maybe we'll go down there and just assault him really quick and then step inside his base and take a look around. Um, I assume that he's got storage of some kind, things like that, but um, right now with the door being closed, there's not much we can do because we don't have grenades. Now, last time I was in here, uh, I talked about getting some grenades together and it's a little expensive to make them. Um, basically, what did you need? You needed 50 gunpowder. And in order to make gunpowder, you had to have 5 potassium. I'm, I'm going off memory. I hope I have this right. 5 potassium. But when I made it, uh, with I thought, is this 1 to 1? Do I need, like, a ton of potassium? Well, anyway, when you actually spend 5, it makes 10 at a time. And you need 50. Or 40? 40. So anyway, I think I need like 20 potassium. Uh oh. Uh, so anyway, I've got more of that to do, which obviously then costs power and everything. So, oh, there's two. You sneaky guys. So anyway, I haven't made a grenade yet. So as I mentioned, we can't quite get in there yet. So there's really no point in assaulting them. Um, I seem to recall, man, I should have gone back and looked. The other guy I killed, I can't remember if he had anything when I searched him. Um, I don't recall offhand. I seem to recall being able to search him, but I don't think he had anything cool. I feel like I would remember that. <laughs> Be like, yeah, he had a bunch of cool stuff. So anyway, we're going to go ahead and leave them alone for now, since the door is closed. But um, let's get up here and take a look, because I'm sitting here babbling about numbers, and I figure I should double check that. Oh, let's check our plants too. Okay, so these are full. I think they've been full and still said cancel, so I don't entirely know. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. <laughs> I've only run by here real quick and done this in glance. So you actually can hand uh, pick these. Let's go ahead and do this now. Let's go ahead and pick all these guys. So I probably could have picked these up earlier. Um, and check our inventory. Ooh, lots of cotton from that. Tomatoes, excellent. Okay, now can I do anything from this? So I can split them and eat them. But I don't see an option for seeds. That could be an option, though, in my crafting menu. Let's just step in here and close the door. <laughs> um, because I haven't looked for any of this before. Um, I don't think so, but yeah. How about here? Seems like a weird thing to do out of here. Yeah, I don't see anything. Uh, but we do have seeds, right? We've got a bunch of seeds, so we might as well get these planted, especially since we're about to be burning water in here and fertilizer. Um, so we have the cotton and more tomato, right? I don't re really have anything else. Uh, should we just do, like, can't shift click these. Um, four and four, I guess. I mean... Maybe a bit, maybe, um, maybe we'll do that. More cotton, because at least we can make some stuff with that. Tomatoes are great, right? Food, but we can get food from other places. Okay, let's, um, let's step in here really quick. I wanted to see, um, so padded cloth, we would need some feathers. This gets into where having an animal would be good and the animal housing would be good. Um, because we're on that topic, let's just peek really quick. Uh, not that expensive, actually. That's not bad at all. Um, I will have to gather some wood. I've already gathered it from the big tree out front. Um, so I'll have to wait. Um, but anyway, that could be a thing we could do. But let's get back to the grenade situation. Scroll down here. So you can see we need 50 gunpowder, some iron fragments, some copper fragments. Um, so this isn't terribly bad. But let's go to the gunpowder, and you can see it's 5 potassium, and this makes 10. I would love to see that. I would love to see this say, like, 10 quantity here, so that we know how much it's going to make. Uh, plenty of ash, and a number of you have been commenting about leaving this um, running. It's just more efficient, so you're not burning matches. Um, I've agreed, so I've been trying to keep this going. Additionally, we, of course, get more ash as long as we keep this running. So we're going to do that. Um, 
but let's step over here really quick. We've got uh, the potassium in here. So I think I'm going to run this again. You can see our power is doing pretty good. Let's just go ahead and turn this on. And I think we'll let this burn through the rest of the potassium, but we're also going to have to wait through the night. Um, if I turn, I can turn the light on, but <laughs> so much power wasted. I was so excited about having a light, and then once I had it, I just never use it. But um, there we go. We're going to wait through the night, and hopefully we can, um, I don't know. Can we make a grenade? It's going to be eight. No, we're not going to be able to make a grenade. Probably going to have to go on a mining run. But anyway, tomorrow's a new day. We'll we'll try and get some work in then. Okay, the hunt for potassium begins. I've actually left a lot of stuff back in the base. I'm carrying basically what you see below and these guys. It's pretty much stuff I've picked up. Yeah, just a couple things basically between here and the base. I just stepped out. But... Uh, yeah, I'm going to run around and gather some things and try to get some potassium going. I did make some. I forgot if I mentioned that. I just now made some. Um, so I got a little bit more, but man, I make 10 at a time. It's kind of expensive. And so I've got 20. We need 30 more. 30 more. Uh, let's see. That's three more gunpowder um, times five potassium. So we need 15 more in order to make a grenade. And it's not super clear to me what potassium looks like. Uh, the stuff that I've gathered so far was mostly done with the axe. I was hardly paying attention during those times. It was like, oh, this that's a metal here. Let me just gather some of this. <laughs> so what I have, I just have because it happened to be in front of me at one point. Um, I know it's lighter and I think they look pretty similar to um, iron. So we're going to run out this way, basically. Because I don't often come out here. Um this close to the mountain um, man I thought I would just see some like right off the bat that's my phone let me mute this <laughs> okay oh that was weird this branch let me turn like this look, look at this branch right here as soon as I looked up it was moving down like that just like that and I thought a tree was falling down I was like whoa because they don't they don't uh, do that <laughs> freaked me out um, let's see, we're going to hop up here, take a peek around, let's see, man, I might be totally blind too, just yakking up, but yakking up a storm here and totally missing the metals, but, um, oh, here we go, can I reach this though? Oh, let's, <laughs> swing and jump wing. <laughs> That's not working. <laughs> uh, we'll leave that be. Maybe we'll get luckier over here. And that's my phone. Them leaving a message. Let's see. Um, hmm. Let's grab this guy, of course. We have puppies around here. Alright, let's check this guy out. What do we have here? That's yeah, iron. Well, we've got the pick. It doesn't take very long. So if I start on one and it's not what I'm looking for, I'm probably going to finish it anyway. <laughs> um, okay, let's backtrack. Let's go back towards the base. Um, check some of the rocks around. Oh, boy. Sorry about my phone. Let me, uh, while I run, turn this down. Down, down, down. There we go. You're not following me, are you? Cool. <laughs> it's funny because when I'm not mining... Metal is everywhere. I'm constantly just like, oh, there's three nearby, like near each other. And oh, there's two more right around the corner from those three. Crazy metals everywhere. And then I pull out the pick and start looking for it, and it's all gone. Hmm. Who's over here a bit? Whoops. Excuse me. Sorry. <laughs> nope. Sorry. Run. He's going to follow me a little bit. So we now have at least four hunters. Um, we've got uh, two hunter bases and two hunters in each one that we know of right now. It kind of makes me wonder about the original um, hunter base because it's they've been around for longer. And I think when the other one showed up with its first hunter, the uh, original base had two hunters at that point. That's going to be a locked box. No key. Sorry. Don't know where you are. Trying to leave you alone. 
So anyway, it makes me wonder, does the other one now have three hunters? Maybe we'll go investigate that. Actually, we're somewhat near them, come to think of it. Let's grab this bag real quick. Oh, I don't have my gun. Actually, that's for the best, I think. It's not like I'm going to attack them. Okay, get my bearings. That is there, which means they are like this way. Got a bear right there. Hug this rock. Okay. Um, let's see. Another bear there. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to get a good look here. Good way to know. Look at him. They got a balcony there. The second floor of their place is nice. Ben, this is what you've been telling me to do, right? In the comments you said, make half of your roof an attic and the other half a balcony. So there you go. They took your advice. <laughs> they stole your idea. Um, so the creepy thing is, I don't see anybody. I'm sure they're around here. Do we dare go closer? Can we access their fire, their campfire? Where are they? Ooh, do you see that? 200 ash? <laughs> I'm definitely taking that from these guys. Very cool. Um, where are they? Are they in their base? Let's go up here. Uh-oh. I heard a banging. I don't know why I hide behind the trees. I don't feel like they actually protect you from anything. I don't know where these guys are. I don't think I can do anything with the pick. Wait, am I marking that? Is it cracking? Okay, it's leaving little little holes, but I don't think these are actually doing anything. I think you have to have the grenade to get in. Okay, let's leave their base alone and get back to finding metals. <laughs> okay, getting back to base here. I was actually going to go over to the back to the other hunter's camp, but thought I would swing in here because I've kind of been picking up things, right, as I've been running around. And I thought I would just drop stuff off. Look at all that ash I stole from those guys. <laughs> I was totally trolling and banging on their door. So let's just drop all this off. Um, oh, actually, I was kind of trying to separate this stuff. Let me do this. Um, for those curious, because I don't think I've mentioned it, you probably could have guessed at this point, but I've been kind of separating this as, like, I don't know, organic slash food stuff and, like, metals and rock, you know, that kind of stuff. So... Anyway, there we go. That's that's separated. Um, throw the water in there. And I'll keep the pick because I'm going to continue to look for metal while we're out. They're not that expensive to remake if I do die and lose it. But what I wanted to do is I kind of wanted to go, since I trolled one hunter, I wanted to go back to these guys and um, hit them up. Um, but obviously I want to hit some metal on the way. Hopper is good. I keep running into iron. I feel like this is iron as well. Probably. Yeah, more iron. Still no potassium, um, but I will grab copper because in my running around so far I haven't run into any today. Let's grab this guy too. Okay, copper, copper. It'd be kind of cool if they mixed in some other stuff. Like, yeah, you're going to get copper from copper, but maybe you'll get like one potassium or you'll get one iron or something like that. Um, Okay, let's try and be somewhat sneaky. Even if I'm not going to crouch, I shouldn't just go blazing up there. I'd love to hit up their campfire and take their ash, now that I know you can do that. <laughs> It'd be pretty awesome. Um, okay, we've got a wolf between here and there. Oh, something I didn't know about the, um, the animals. Um, I had just discovered in the last video, I think it was, that they level up. I, I read that in the tip. Um, if they kill you, they level up. So I thought, oh, okay, that's kind of cool. Well, anyway, somebody mentioned uh, in the comments that they had been killed over and over again by a bear. I think it was a bear. And that bear was now level four. And I was like, whoa, I didn't know they would level above three. I thought three was like the max. So that's kind of crazy if you ended up with a bear nearby and like near your base or whatever, um, killing you over and over again. 
I mean, I would imagine there's got to be some way around that, you know, some way you can kind of, you could get out and sprint by them or something. Um, but that's kind of cool. I didn't know that they could actually level above four. So I think these guys are a little too active out here. I could certainly sprint down there, hit it, try to loot real quick, but they're going to certainly shoot me, and I probably wouldn't make it very far before I died. Um, oh, I was like, what is that, a gunshot? <laughs> now, maybe that's worth it. Um... For how much ash is in there I don't know but oh there's the other guy so I'm kind of wanting to just see and their door is closed yeah I was hoping he would maybe go inside his base like if he went in and closed the door I would like sneak around the other side and then sprint up there real quick and try it but I think we're gonna go ahead and pass on that for now um, sorry wolf we're just gonna continue on our run or search for uh, metal I would pick up that box that I just ran by but those wolves would be on me quick. Let's go over here. We got some rocks over here we can check out. Let's see. I'm going to stay on this chicken really quick because I'm sprinting already. There he goes. He's going to stop. Let me catch up, buddy. Come here, buddy. I definitely need to start collecting these guys um, as I can. If I've got some easy ones or I'm running right by one. Ugh, so close. Next time. Just slow down your mind. Yeah, gotcha. <laughs> Sweet. Okay, cool. That took me farther from the rocks <laughs> over here than I wanted to go, but that's okay. We'll cruise back here. Um, I guess I got turned around. I didn't know I was right by the base. I'll probably just check these rocks around here and then uh, drop off stuff again. Here we go. See, I think this is going to be iron again. I'm trying to pay attention to what this stuff looks like right now, so I kind of know. So it certainly was iron. I'm very curious about the difference visually because I may start skipping iron at some point okay so I think this is zinc um, let's try though ah oh, man creepy that was creepy did you hear that I swear it was footsteps <laughs> I heard like stepping oh creep me out I was like somebody's walking right up on me Whew. Oh, Weem, you're so jumpy. Okay, um... Let's see. I don't see any obvious rock or uh, metals here. Maybe we'll run across the face of this since I see scrap down here. Pick this guy up. Yoink. Uh, okay, so we do have one up top. I'm gonna have, have to actually run around to get that. Maybe I can get up here. Ugh. There we go. Okay. Ooh, okay, so this is promising. Um, yeah, this is much more white, right? The other one was really gray. Okay, there we go. Potassium. So it's just very, um, it's much more bright. The iron was actually pretty dull. Like a dull gray. Things to note. Okay, let's try our luck one more time before the sun goes down. There happens to be a box on this little hill overlooking our two new hunters here. And I saw one of them walking over to the left somewhere over there. So let's just grab this really quick. Look up a little bit higher here. You can see I've been gathering all kinds of stuff. Oh boy, I hear you. Ah! No. No boy. Okay. So let's see. Uh, let's see if I can quickly spot them. Try to stay away from that wolf. And that bear. Um, okay. One there, and the other one went around the house there. So, anyway, this is probably not going to be a thing I can do. Um, as much as I would like to troll these guys. <laughs> I really want to get in there and get their ash. They're just around that corner. Oh, he's got his gun out. Run, Weem. He saw me. He turned towards me. <laughs> I don't want him to get my stuff. Alrighty, well, I think this has been a good run. Um, how's my stamina? My stamina is good. Let's chase this chicken down since we're running this way anyway. And um, then we'll get back in there and see what we can do. Probably get some of this potassium going. I, I have found uh, two more um, that were mined. So I don't know what my quantity is, how much I have exactly. Uh, I haven't really dug through my inventory fully yet. Don't run towards that wolf. Don't you run towards that wolf. No. 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 Never mind. Gimme. Go. 
<laughs> I really thought I was going to aggro him. I know he's walking this way. Let's take a look. All right, we've got a little bit of room. Let's grab this real quick. Looks like iron. Oh, I'm not close enough. Where'd he go? Oh, okay. That's fine. We got just far enough away. Okay. Phew. <laughs> Let's get up here. Let's get back inside, get this going. Um, actually, you know what? I see one here. I'm going to check the rocks around here um, really quick before we get in. I've gone too far. <laughs> I shouldn't have gone after that chicken. <laughs> Can I hit you with that? Uh. Oh, he's going to kill me. That's all right. Oh. <laughs> oh, man. There it is. Your drop kit will respawn in five minutes. Okay, I didn't get that tooltip last time. Hey look, it's a campfire I put down a long time ago. <laughs> Actually, let's check this really quick. Uh, nothing there, okay, cool. So, I, I respawned, I know exactly where I'm at. We're not too far away. Um, whoa. Pick that up real quick. The base is, we don't have the indicator for it yet, but it's like right over that way. Um, or straight ahead, one of the two. Um, so anyway, we're gonna cruise over here. There's our mountain, our double-eared mountain. Uh, so we know we're this way. Um, I'm gonna loot along the way. And then when I get in there, when I get back to the base, I will break down the potassium, like I said, and uh, see where we're at. I don't know that I'll have enough to make a grenade, but if I don't have enough, I think I'll just keep working on that and um, try to make that the goal of the next episode. Is Maybe we can get prepped up enough to go after the uh, hunters, the newer hunters, down the hill. So I think that would be pretty cool. Um, but... I'm gonna keep you here really quick. Let's walk over and see if my corpse is still down here. I hope my kit is still there. I have had a couple issues with that recently. Let's see if that's been resolved. So let's see. Um, sometimes I get a little turned around here, but that is that, yes. So we were down here. Should be, ooh. Should be here somewhere, right? Oh, it's gonna get dark on me too. Uh, okay, I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I was in here somewhere. Um, but it is getting very dark, which is really unfortunate. <laughs> uh, I guess I have this guy, but it's not gonna help me a whole lot. I do have some other crates around here. There we go, there's my box. Sweet, let's get all my stuff back. Okay, um, so yeah, like I said, I'm going to get everything together, see what we can do. Maybe next time we'll be able to run a raid on the uh, hunters below. I suppose you'll be able to tell by the title of the video, uh, <laughs> the next video, whether that's something we get to do. Unless I troll you guys and I call it something completely unrelated. But anyway, I do want to thank you guys for watching. As always, I really appreciate it. I hope you guys come back for the next one.